season of love is upon us and we no doubt have stuffed to check out in game. It looks like they've redecorated the island. A lot. Today we don't really know what's going to be coming, but I am really hoping for Ray Yostridge. If we have Ray Yostridge, my life is complete today. I'm not really expecting anything else, but if we do get something else, it would be a massive surprise. Activities too, we got a new button to the side. I saw before we booted up the game that we've got some kind of new update inside of the game. So that should be quite exciting to see. Oh my goodness, we finally have a conundrum button. Here we go. I've wanted something like that because I've been wanting to check out what my conundrum going on oh my god and the fact that we have finally buttons for the castle outside of it you know what that's gorgeous love that so much okay let's head on over now to i see what's going on we've got ray your strange yes this is what i've been wanting no mythical today we did say it'd be coming in the next few weeks though so not really many surprises there maybe if we go on the loading screen we might get a little glimpse <gasps> the island is looking festive it's resident seasonal has arrived what Yay, as but what's going on here? We've got more seasonal. No way! The redecorated Air Island. Air Island is never this festive. What is going on? It looks like they've redecorated the island. A lot. Air Island usually just has some flowers going on, but here we got massive flowers spiraling. Why have they done this for the season of love, though? Oh, is it the beginning of all of these seasonal skins getting a bit more festive? I adore this. That's the biggest surprise for me, like, ever. Just booting up a seasonal skin, ever. Wow. Got a statue to the side of a monster on top. Who could that be? Got Cupid going on. You know, I'm going to put up an image here comparing the Season of Love Island to the new one. It's so much better. I adore this so much. Wow. The new seasonal skins are just killing it. We need way more of these things. Now, let the, let's go and see what we've got going on with the costumes. Because we're feeling the love right now. Oh my god, they did a Rebro one. Yes. <laughs> I'm getting served today, man. Look at this love machine look at that bow tie looking snazzy rebro as snazzy as ever my boy wait where are we we're over here what if we paired them up with yastridge over here because yastridge has a suit attire too look first date i'm not saying about shipping here but those are the only two date outfits inside of the game so if you're gonna pair two monsters together for a duet or whatever rebro and yastridge just saying <laughs> The season of love is in the air. Uh, let's move on to his next costume. Okay, so we need to work out here what the teaser one was because I'm quite confused towards what that could be. Oh my god, we got one for Stuart too. Stuart. This is a lot more mummy-like. I'm not seeing the love as much with this, so I need to see what this is about a bit more closer up here. Stuart, where are you? There you are. We got sandals and a more mummy Egyptian look. Is this supposed to be a season of of love one i don't get it i mean i am vibing it but i'm not seeing the season of love attire to it oh it's supposed to be like one of the cupid people isn't it ah uh, i see now the wings oh okay fair enough and picture you were looking in the wrong direction there it was pretty obvious too <laughs> paper q oh my god <laughs> these costumes serving love heart i don't like that a more subtle one yet yeah, just really custom to paul sona very crafty i really like paul sona's bunny costume that is literally probably my second favorite costume alongside ostriches it's a really good one what about us other ones oh i knew we'd be getting rare and epic ones too what if we had we've had three so far so we've got a lot here hi bops we've got mistletoe surrounding this <laughs> I love that so much. I mean, it goes with your green. We've not actually got his epics out there. I'll have to go inside of his hotel and get it. Here's Epic Cybop. It looks like he's got some... Nah, it's just the mistletoe. The purple's putting me off a bit with my color blindness. <laughs> That's why I'm getting a bit confused. Oh, we got Love Hearts in there too. All right, that is right, cool. I'm in love with the skin so much. If we get all of these for the rest of the seasonal events too... I'm here. I'm here for it. Oh, man. Ah, there we go. He is the perpetrator, Ramor. Of course it's Ramor. MPG. Oh, it doesn't align, MPG. It doesn't align with the blob at the bottom. No, it totally aligned with the blob at the bottom. They were doing that to tease you off, MPG. Trust your instincts, everyone. It was Ramor. We were saying it can't be Ramor. It was Ramor. 
There you go. Always trust your instincts, everyone. <laughs> That's pretty cute. We love monstrous being put on places too. I really like deciphering it. <gasps> it's Alice in Wonderland style here. Yeah, pom pom. Homecoming queen. Yeah, serving the looks real queen-like. I can see it's supposed to be based on Alice in Wonderland. Totally from that name as well. Oh, that is so cool. Rebro's my favorite though. Please. Alice in Wonderland was literally my favorite film as a kid growing up. I would watch it a thousand and one times. And now I can put all my pom-poms in this outfit. I'm going to be buying that on every island. Turox too. How many? We got Dwayne the Turox. Someone made me name it Dwayne the Turox on a live stream. And I have no regrets. It's more like a dog now. So you got a holler like a dog. Okay, I, I get the reference there. Rebro. You've served, though. You have made this event for me. No, the skin has made it, truly. Oh, we have a Quarister costume, too. No way. I really like when they do costumes offsetting each one. So we got Ray, yours, Regia, and a Quarister one. Okay. We've got lots of new costumes there. That's really epic. I like how we finally got some new ones, too. At Christmas, we just kind of got returning ones. I think this is supposed to be based on the Chinese and Korean version. We got Ray Dandy Doo as well. <laughs> We're really serving the Dr. Zeus fan. Red Dandy Doo is totally Dr. Zeus. So we've got even more of that that looks right here. You've got those little creatures that roam around, Whoville. That's literally that costume. Love that. And look at that. That is literally the Teddy costume from the Chinese and Korean versions of the game. Yeah, that is totally the Chinese one. Right, let's go though now and check out Red Yarp Strange. We're going for an evil look. So I'm hoping that they do serve on that. Although anything, the Red Mythicals are awesome so far. Let's have a look. Oh my god. <laughs> like the Lorax. We've got some Dr. Zeus vibes in the room. That is really weird. Like a fly? All right, what is down with you, Ray Yostridge? We've got to see a little bit more about this thing because it's put my appetite now. One in every 55 Yostridges is born with a specific genetic mutation that produces radically different colored plumage and converts their avian wings into insectoid ones. A bit curious. Not sure whether I'm vibing that. Do we have a similar thing for Schlepp going on? I explain things a little bit. <laughs> Rather than feeling self-conscious about what sets it apart, this rare mythical celebrates its differences and leans into it as you should, perhaps even going overboard. It styles elaborate feather -dos by burying its head in sand and allows yucca seed pods, which are the things found around the air island if you go in at the paths there to take root on its body and grow a miniature ecosystem on its back gotta love it when monsters embrace their weirdness well and truly this makes me think of turtwig the pokemon so it evolves into i can't remember his name it's the huge one in detective pikachu anyway yeah I, i'm really excited about this now insectoid i like that I like that a lot. We are being served this season of love. I know y'all should just breed in combo, so we're all good. Not gonna use as diamonds today. I think I understand why they've done the seasonal skins. It's probably because we're paying for them now, so we can have them permanently. I find it really cool though that everyone can still experience them at the same time. That is so exciting though that we're gonna get to discover that's Oh, Ray, y'all right there. Epic. Well, not epic. Rare. <laughs> We're digging it. I'm gonna move Yostridge into the hotel. McDoodleson. Goodbye. Your time has gone now. Oh, your hotel is full. Unfortunately, your time really has come to go. <laughs> you gotta go away from the island completely, love. Here we go, Ray Yostridge. Oh man, that is really weird. Those wings are please. It's more like a scarecrow than anything else, isn't it? It's fierce anyway, at least. Yeah, we've been getting lots of insectoid things in my singing monsters recently. And I don't know why, but I feel like that's gonna continue. Which excites me, but also really irks me. Ray Ostrich, let's take a look. I think when they sing, we're gonna see some differences with the mouth here. Wow, it really is like a scarecrow. Look at that. I wouldn't have guessed yellow, but I really like it. Got some vines surrounding it, wooden. Yeah, really weird. Just elementary monsters. I thought for sure they would have changed the mouth more. It's all a bit. That is really different though in comparison to the other one though, so I really don't mind. Okay, I'm gonna actually go ahead and teleport this to Myth Island two hour here. 
try and check out what this thing is like over here too. As you know what, Mythical Island is my favorite thing that's releasing right now. I don't feel like that's to anyone's surprise though, because Mythical Island is literally the best thing happening. <laughs> so we got to obviously check out here too. <laughs> Please, look. I have just realized something. You can be best buddies now. Look, Schlepp, you finally got a friend here. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that face, it's just done with the world. And Ray Yostridge is actually quite happy. <laughs> Quite the conflict there, but you know what? You can counterintuitize each other. I don't even think that is a word. You can conflict with one another and create happiness on Mythical Island. There you go. <laughs> Schlep, you finally got a pal. You got so much today. If you enjoyed this, uh, please do make sure to leave a like down below. And what on earth do you think about the Air Island stuff that has come today? A lot more than what I was expecting, honestly. And who knows? Maybe we'll get to discover the Mythical soon. But for now, guys, I'll see you later. Bye, guys.